Our mission is to actually take time to listen to what customers' concerns are and to find out what they need. We're one of the oldest long-running insurance providers in Chilliwa. We've been providing insurance for 80 plus years. Because it's a family business, we treat our customers like family. Especially with house insurance, people understand that this is their greatest investment. And so we wanted to make it easy to understand. We do that simply and with as less stress as possible. People come in our door, I always try and just make sure that I put a smile on their face and go from there. We have customers that have been here for many, many years, and then their children and now even their grandchildren. So it's very nice feeling that they keep coming back. Major with suspension added. I believe it was just last season. It happened here at the Sardis Sports Complex. But alas, we digress. Vanderkoy rips it, he scores! Welcome back, Ryder Vanderkoy. <laughs> Vanderkoy back from suspension. And oh boy, did you miss him? Pavely felled in front of his own net. Here's Denisenko going down the other way. Denisenko centered in front and a big denial by Weinstein Smith. Backhand, another blocker save for Weinstein Smith. Four seconds left. The power play virtually gone for the Kodiaks here. As Brideau will wing that one around to the near side. Mark Miranov. Can he come away with it? He does. Miranov, deep move. In tight, he scores! Oh, beautiful move. Some Miranov magic from the hangar. Coming off the far side wall. Upstairs on Roberts. Here's the rebound. Clausel shoots down low. Ends up in behind the cage. A dozen seconds remaining in front. Roberts able to get the trapper down on it. And Weinstein Smith can't cover it, so it stays alive for Chilliwack again. Some tired bodies out here for Aldergrove. Marshall through traffic in front. Big save by Weinstein Smith. Oh. Just put the lumber out and see what happens. Weinstein eats you, whether you're a friend, family member, or fan. Here's Quiring in front. Oh. Backhander, oh. another great stop for Weinstein Smith. Thanks. Yeah, he wasn't out there for the last penalty kill either, and he's usually out there, so. Here's a shot by Miranov, denied again by Weinstein Smith. Denisenko, a booming check on Russell. In front, loads, fire, scores! Eric Rommel makes it 3-0 Chilliwack off a nice shot between the dots. Miranov plays it to the right wing for Jesse Bridoux. Bridoux, wrist shot, that one stopped up by the body of Bergen George as the two of them will grab onto each other and they're gonna go at it. Bridoux throwing some bombs at Bergen George, a haymaker, and the two of them drop down onto one another. As Bridoux and Bergen get busy at the Sardis Sports Complex. I don't think I had that on my bingo card that uh, Jesse Bridoux would be uh, throwing hands with Bergen George because uh, while the uh, the Jets' uh, regular season goal scorer, or regular season point getter from last year, has contributed significantly. Uh, that's not something you see very often from Jesse Bridau. And Suspension from the playoffs last year tonight, so Merrick Bridau should draw back in in his brother's place. And now here's another headlock given off of the draw. This is going to draw a crowd. I'm not sure what resulted in that headlock is some of the players trying to drop the gloves here. We got two separate players with the gloves dropped to the officials. Here's another one as Kalen Hybers is on top of a player there. The officials, the referees, are actually going to have to get involved with separating as we've got three separate altercations going on here. And smart of Marshall and Denisenko to just back away. So it was Quiring going at it with Lindsay. They gave each other a fist bump. Part of me it was Rommel and Lindsay. They gave each other a fist bump. And then Mark Miranov, looking a little bit bloodied off his lip there. He was going at it with Beering. But you want to see a Jan Beering is still trying to goad Martin here. Penalty coming up, wrist shot. 
And watch yourself as you head into the wall as Beering yeah. is still not really caring. There's another slash by Beering. I just, I don't understand this at the end of the game. It's like, it's no different than what we saw last season in like, say, Case the Bird yes. George penalty yep. last season, where you've lost the game, take your hockey bag and go home. Vanderkoy was on an island on that near side and ended up passing it to the far side. I wonder if there was supposed to be a rotation down low. Back up to Marini, double clutch, shoot, score! Matteo Marini, power play goal with under 90 seconds to go. He'll drive the wedge to four. Yeah, but in the PJHL, incur an automatic one game suspension on top of the 10 minute piece as Vanderkoy will add on to his tally, cleaning up at the back post, his second power play goal of the night. And Chilliwack lead 5 0. Backhander down low and sell. To shoot that one off of the boards and around. Benisenko, as time winds down, the officials will move in one last time, but despite all the physicality, tonight's contest will come to an end at 5 0. The Chilliwack Jets improved 2 0 on the early PJHL campaign. Yeah, and uh, again, like, like Langley, this one is a little bit more of a complete performance. Although the fact that the uh, the Jets really let the Kodiaks hang around for a good part of this game, managed to uh, step on the gas when it was needed, getting the second and third power play goals sure helped. And uh, the Jets will salute the fans here and send them home happy as the Jets start 2-0 the first two home games here of the season.